If I can't extend my knee in a week's time, they're gonna operate on it. Hello YouTube! Day. What are you saying guys? Ben here. I'm gonna take what are you saying guys? Ben go here. What are you saying guys? Ben Skates here. I'm gonna take another journey with Ben Skates here. What are you saying guys? Ben Skates here. What are you saying, guys? I'm also going to be talking about saying, how guys? skateboarding saved my life. What are you saying, guys? Um, how important Spend skateboarding is in my what life. Saying, guys? My issue with what are you addiction. Saying, guys? What are you saying, guys? To Spend overcoming that. Saying, guys? To get Spend where I am today. Saying, Please remember guys? to Spend like and subscribe you if you enjoy. What are you saying, guys? Spend skates here. What are you saying, guys? Spend skates here. What are you saying, guys? Spend skates here. I've got my appointment today to find out whether I am going to have an operation. Um. Yeah, I'm a little bit nervous. I've got something special for you this week. I've been filming the homies. That I've put an edit together of some of the tricks that they've been doing, some of the mad tricks they've been doing. So I hope you enjoy. Yes, James. Yo! Are you going to count now? Yo, that was insane, bro. Dang. <laughs> See that? Yeah, I'm going to be on TV. <laughs> Thank you all for watching. I really appreciate all the support. So it's currently <laughs> 20 past 3 and the temperature is I think 22 degrees today. It's going to be too long till I'm back actual skating, which is cool. I am 100% having uh, surgery now which is fantastic um, so it's just letting my knee heal by itself and coming back really slowly skateboarding has been a massive part of my life for a while now um, not as long as I'd like it to be but it's been about five years every bit of it's been a blessing 
you know, learning tricks, being around the skate skating. Skate park's like a sanctuary to me. I don't like skaters, to be honest. You know, it's where we can shut off from all our anxiety and life problems as such, you know. So, you know, I can't thank, I can't thank skateboarding enough. It's, uh, it's a beautiful sport. It's about time that skateboarding got a bit more respect than, you know, the, the judgmental we're reprobates villain. That's what drove us down that path. You know, the skater, I always felt like I was an outsider. I've always felt like an outsider anyways. But as a skateboarder, you always feel a lot more outside the circle than, than uh, of life than anyone else, really. The whole community from the skate park, BMX, scooters, uh, skateboarders, roller skaters, etc. We know sometimes we all feel a little bit out of the circle. Sometimes, you know, it's, less, it's not very nice. You know, it makes you feel a little bit less. I'm really glad that we're getting a bit of understanding of what we do and how hard it is. I struggled a lot through addiction. It doesn't matter what it could be. It could be addicted to anything. You know, that obsession and compulsion about something you can just control my life. It's been clean for nine months um, and somewhat serene. And my life has changed from if it wasn't for addiction, I wouldn't have created this YouTube channel. It wouldn't have given me the strength to have the confidence to do something like this, you know, and to try and have a career in skateboarding until like nine months ago. You say like three teen years, you know, you're supposed to enjoy yourself and stuff. It's not enjoying. Don't get me wrong, some of it was good, but most of it was just unnecessary drama. I'm just so grateful and full of appreciation for everyone that's helped me out. And I've completely changed my life, and I, I couldn't have done it without them. So if any of you guys are in need, or you need help, or you're struggling, give me a comment, give me a message on my Instagram, or my TikTok, anything, you know, on any of my socials, and I will undoubtedly help you out because I need to spread the message of recovery for myself and for you. For anyone that's struggling out there, just connect. Connect to someone. You know, sometimes it's worth just talking about it, to share the weight. It makes the situation feel so much better. You know, for a while I've got to, I wasn't sharing the weight of my issues. And you know, it got worse and worse and worse and it's like that downward spiral that never ever ends. But then I found the light at the end of the tunnel which I can say that I'm present in my life. I have a good life. And I can connect with people without worrying. You know, it's, it's a great life man. You know, it's what you make of it and I'm making something out of mine. Thanks for tuning in. If you enjoy the content I'm putting out there. Every week from now, upload day will be on a Sunday Please remember to because like and subscribe. I am linking up with Cumbria Movement and we will be filming together and hopefully maybe doing a podcast possibly.